Crystal Isles has just released, and me and my tribe are back on Small Tribes. But this time, things are a bit different. See, we're not gonna settle for just being one of the big tribes on this server. No, this time, we're taking this server over. So sit back, relax, and enjoy, and welcome to Crystal Isles. Alright guys, so, bit of a slower day today, not a whole lot's been popping off, just dropping that uh, Quetzal with the replicator on it and getting a lot of grinding done, but on a whim I went to go and check the uh, golem spawns which have been notoriously shitty on Crystal Isles for us so far, and I actually lucked out and found a 145, and as luck would have it, with uh, the kibble uh, wyverns that we tamed the other day, um, we actually have enough eggs to where we should be able to kibble tame this thing. So hopefully the HP stat on it is not too abysmal. I guess it wouldn't be the end of the world if it had high melee as well, because we could use it for like base defense or something like that. Which is mainly what we're taming golems for anyways, because tech turrets rip straight through them. It's not even funny. Um, but we're going to go ahead and knock this thing out, and then we're going to throw the kibble in and see what we end up with. It'll be nice to actually not uh, have to wait 37 years for this thing to tame. Oh, okay. Didn't hit it, right? I... not with that last one, but I think you might have when it was just going down. Which is a yikes. It's only got like 30k health. Oh well, I mean, we'll put the cable in. Not like we can't make more. Interesting. Eh, it's not terrible. I mean... It's 1k better than our uh, sulfur yeah, cane one. Yeah, it's definitely not, it's decidedly not good, but yeah. you know what, I'll take it. What's the melee on it? Nah, that, even that's not that good. Wow, what a letdown. Kibble Tamed Golem came at 11k health, only 280 melee. And then somebody drowned it. Oh <laughs> so man, we lived on that the, sucks. We lived on the iceberg and they drowned it walking across to the... To the land is pretty epic. Oh yeah, that was when things could drown like that. Yeah, like it drowned like immediately. Yikes, dude. All right, yeah, we're pro too. gamers, like literally professionals. Yeah, I've never messed this up before, by the way. All right, start spacing That's your it. shots. Okay. I protected you. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go look at this melee. Let's go look at this melee. One fifty. I don't want to talk about it. We're just going to assume that that's not going to be the case again, guys. Well, it's it, it's got to go up, right? What is its melee? It, it is 10% worse than the last one. Oh my god. How is that possible? <laughs> um, I, You know what? We got a really, really bad roll, though, the last time. We only got, like, isn't each level equivalent to 5%? Yeah, but you have to remember, it gets reduced and then it gets the levels put into it. How many, how many percent does each level matter? A lot, not, I mean, each level is like 2%. Alright, it's gamer time, time boys. Trade. Ready, ready? 170 is going to turn into 215 right here. 130 Zero. right Zero. here. Zero. Literally 10. Well, it goes down 80, so realistically Ten. we could get 100. Like... 100, even. Just funny. call it 100. <laughs> I believe, 210, minimum. We got 100 and we're taking a giga again. <laughs> 20k health. 20k health. Yo, Let's I go. wouldn't actually care that much if it was that high. Oh! Oh, oh my! God. Get in the water! Get in the water! Get in the water! Get in the water! Peter, what were you saying? <laughs> I don't want to talk it's about it. It's not 130. All right, <laughs> wow, we can how we how can trade bad? this. We can trade this though. It's okay. No, we can trade this. I don't this. think we can. Yes, we can. Somebody will be like, they'll tame a high level female, right? And they'll be like, I need a male, and we'll be like, Yo, listen, listen, listen. Our male. It do be having 18k health though. You know what I mean? So. I mean, I'll combo it. I don't even. Shouldn't even notice, maybe. It's like in the middle of those strikes. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Let's see. Oh, we have no beat on it from here. We gotta take out the uh, adolescent one first. Oh yeah, just from that. And that's that. That thing's gone. There we go, 
246. Yeah. What are you plugging away at? That UD. I want to finish him off. Oh, yeah, shit. Let me plug my last 12 into that. Thing is kind of low. I've been flaming it for a while. I, should, I shot all my comp arrows into it. He should almost be dead. There Boom, you go. there you go. Means you want, we can go back and grab shotgun. Yeah, let's kill all the wyverns. Let's go back and get stuff to kill all the wyverns. <laughs> is that like a weird pseudo vault drop they have going on there? I think that's just their vaults. Bro, <laughs> it's just I their story. I don't know, man. This this base is weird. They got like doors on the like third floor. What is that? <laughs> it's for peek outs, man. Oh, those strikes are real bloody. Can you finish them off? I ran out of flame arrows. Which ones? The trikes on the right side. <clears throat> They're all like super bloody. Is that RG bloody? Were you shooting that RG? Yeah, I've been shooting it with the long neck. Both those trikes are dead. <laughs> Rip, dude! <laughs> on the front left um body blocking one of their ground turrets <laughs> bro bro they got a fucking diplo callus what oh i'm killing it fuck Bruh. the diplo callus i haven't seen one of those since like beginning of new servers when we were on rag so they get their pearls Cha chad <laughs> <laughs> no not the chad lizard Little did we know they had veggie cakes in their There we go. <laughs> All right. Uh, I actually have to head for a few minutes. If you want to head back to base real quick. Yeah. Uh, I mean, eh, there's not much we can do. Yeah, I mean, I'm that like, was good enough. We need to get more flame arrows made. Got 20 bullets and like 13 flame arrows. So I don't they can eat their uh, their T-Rex and um, it can eat all the the bodies for them. Oh wait, it's really bloody. We should finish that. Oh, is it? Okay. 50 stam? Holy shit. Not anymore. Dead. I mean, shit. what's the cooldown on eating a cake? 30, like 30 seconds. seconds. Yeah, so it's I mean... It's a turtle, then it's cracked, and it doesn't matter. I don't know, that's old. Turtles don't even use cakes anymore. Yeah. You're about to get boogied. Whereas Tammy 2 says it's a turtle, and I ate... I added a cake and it was like 120 seconds. I'm like, okay, that's not cool. That was a dead turtle. Alright, let's get onto this platform here. That weird auto walk thing that wyverns do, do be kind of annoying it. though. I thought that was like only on Windows 10. Look. Right? I feel like a lot of Windows 10, like a lot of problems happen on Windows 10 and they just sort of happen on here too. Like while we were playing it, we just excused it for Windows 10. Kind of fucked. Oh yeah, that's definitely the right side. You're right. Yeah, like I'm like so fucking close to their base right now on foot. Go. I'm Was a right the green shit that just shot at me? Yeah. Yeah, like... I broke into the greenest boys, free bird. <laughs> look, look at this, dude. Look how fucking close you can get. Yeah. I right, have I'm to ready. take out that plan X on the right, though, um, with the skiff or wyvern or something. Okay, but yeah, you'll, yeah. You, actually, you might even not get shot at all if you come from this side. All right, are we just going to hold our shields up and walk with them until we get close and we equip? Uh, well, I'm going to let him wait till I'm getting shot. Or, like, yeah, I'm going to let him push in a little bit first, and then I'm going to run yeah. in underneath of him. 
Okay, with, I'm gonna give you. You got the shields out or with the rockets out? I'm just going rocket out, man. All right, sure. I feel like that's. I feel like that's the play. Honestly, I'm putting my shield in here. All right. Yeah, right. Yeah, me too. Because I don't think the shield realistically is gonna do that much with this many turrets. No attacks. Get your shit yeeted. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. How, how much out are you oh, getting? Oh, not good. Very dead. Racer dead. Uh, yeah, we're not getting in. Yeah, okay. No, we're not getting in there. <laughs> Alright, guys. We're gonna go be space pirates because uh, MTS meta be like, so... <laughs> Zoom. Going these guys that, should be these guys should be offline for another like hour and a half or two hours uh, Maybe longer it depends uh, They have a pretty thick offline timer though, so Let's hope they don't log on midway through us poking a hole in their base with cannonballs. That would be pretty awkward No, they're still off They have a trap door on the top of their base trap door gang <laughs> I think we cannon from this side, so we can get like the clearest line of sight on it, to be honest. Should I put a box up here with the cannonballs in it? Yeah, well, hindsight's uh, 20, 20 like and all. Back. <laughs> We're gonna have to aim up a bit, yeah? Yeah, go to that. Yeet! Wait, did I not damage it? Do that again. Uh, yeah, there's yeah. one wall in like 7k, 7.8. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep shooting there. So here's something you guys might not know about skiffs, and I think it's also the same with quetzals when you're using a cannon. Um, apparently there's a bit of sway if you're not completely landed, uh, at least with the skiff. So you're going to see me get quite a lot frustrated with this because we have to shoot so many more cannonballs at this base than we normally would have to. Because depending on where the skiff is and it's like idle like sway animation of just hovering, it'll shoot like from the distance that we're shooting at about one to two walls higher or lower than where I'm actually aiming. So that's a lot of fun. Got it. I see the rep it. Try not to destroy it because we will not get the loot. Can you guys see like where that Jenny is from there? Like, can you try and get an angle on the Jenny, please. I think that's a really open base. Yeah. Oh, I found a sheep. They have an internal heavy. Okay, get that back to base, but um. <laughs> I can just tame it up. All right, yo, let's. I'm gonna swing around. We're gonna find this uh, Jenny. We're gonna have to reposition and everything, but that's fine. Yeah. Go left. Go to the left. Let me see in that way. Ah, right, yeah. Just you don't have to lay prone. Like you can actually just as okay. long as you're not moving, you can kind of. I just gonna wyvern on the other side. Like a not us wyvern? I uh, I don't yeah. believe it's us. I see. I think where the Jenny is. It's underground. Yeah. The Jenny? No, the fucking person on the wyvern. Where's the Jenny at? Uh, it's in the box right in the middle where we're looking at. It's right in the middle? Yeah, dude. Be careful. Yeah. Then so it might just, be on the ground. Hog angle on it. Aim right center, we'll be fine. So it might be on the ground then if it's on the lowest level. It's fine, we can break the fan, dude. Wait, are I'm you saying using, it like, might the be on the ground okay, and you're saying it's fine, we can just. Um... What? Am I using what? Are you using the particle effect of the generator it's, to find I mean, it? I'm seeing like. The oh yes, yes, I see that. I see that. Yeah. I see that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, um, should I aim? Aim yeah, down. Just fire, yeah. Yeah. Aim down. Aim down a couple of times. We did like 300. Wait, what? I don't see the Jenny. What do you mean? It's right next behind the Deodon. Yeah. We did like yeah. 300 damage. Did 300 damage to it. We need a lot. What are you out now? No, I got some, yeah. but. 600 on that one. That wall, wall is gonna break, and it'll be so much easier for us. All right, so if it's 300 damage and it's 15,000, say, well, let's just say 20,000. 100 for the sake of an that wall. Try to buy. Well, 180. But... We're gonna need like 60 or so cannonballs. Somebody go back get cannonballs. Yeah, we have like 75 cannonballs now. Ah, Here. No. Here. Get on. Hey, buddy.
Well, it's almost broken. How's it not broken? The, the ceiling. Yeah, or just... the, the, the ceiling is 1400. We're not even well. hitting the generator when you hit that wall or the ceiling. Should I aim down? No, 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 no. Just, just, just keep, keep going. Hitting. We'll get through what we need to get through. Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Who did that? I think it just ran out of, uh... No, dude, no! <laughs> Raise up on the other one, AFK. It did, it ran out! No! You tool. Well, calling me a tool now, huh? That hit, but not for a lot. Because it splashed the floor, I think. I wanna scream, dude. I wanna scream. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven walls. Seven times four. We're gonna have to accurately hit the walls though each time. Times four. 112. If we make like 200 cannonballs, we can just drop the whole base. Do you want to go back to base and just craft as many cannonballs as we have resources for? And then let me know how many we have. While I, I continue to like sit here. Keep Hold on. Trying to keep trying to get the generator. Hold on, dude. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rows of six, six, eight rows of six. That's eight times six. We already have 48. If you can make 150 cannonballs, which I mean, is, uh, that's a lot. But... I think we should. We still need to. Like, that just seems so inefficient. I, dude, honestly, I don't see how because I can consistently hit the walls, and that. And by the way, that is me doubling the amount of cannonballs that we would need if every single shot hits like perfectly where we want it to. And there's splash damage on the cannonballs, so you know what I mean. Like here, I'm just gonna open this entire fucking wall up here just to prove my point. Totally did. That's funny. Took down another wall. Did some damage to the Jenny on that too, like a good amount. That, wh where did the damage go? If it didn't go to the generator, where the fuck did it just go? It landed on the generator. Where the fuck is the damage going if it's not like what? <laughs> It's hitting that wall, I think. I'm is it hitting it. the fucking item cache? Is it? I think it is. I'm gonna wait. There's no way that I'm getting this cannon fucking shot off. I hate, I hate this game, dude. I, genuinely, I just want to fucking uninstall. Like, this is so frustrating. And that was pretty much that on that base, guys. We uh, tried the Quetzal thing in the last episode, tried the Pear Racer thing in this episode, and we tried to use cannonballs, but unfortunately, the way the cannonballs were just not connecting, we were only able to get it one-third of its HP down, and then the damage just kept disappearing, going into the vaults behind it, hitting stuff that was, like, nowhere near it. So I'm not exactly sure... I think cannons on skiffs are just not the play. Uh, after we left these guys, because an online cannon situation is just not really, you know, feasible, we were just going to go ahead and wait for the next offline timer and soak their base with trikes. Uh, but unfortunately for us, they ended up giving all of their stuff to, I believe it was Boys in the Hood on server, and they just ended up leaving. And so, yeah. I was a little bit disappointing, but you know, it is what it is. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. So thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one.